Hello and welcome back to Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. Now, we have 21 points and I was thinking of doing something a bit more unique than just going and slapping people, which was picking the level 5 Berserk Insanity. Mainly because it's going to be funny. Uh, that basically turns someone nuts for 30 seconds, attacking everybody within range and then just dropping dead. Which, I don't know, should be good for a giggle or two. Okay. We need to meet this guy at his warehouse, which is fine. I'm sure nothing bad will happen when we go visit the warehouse. It's just a huge area with lots of, like, corners to hide around and, you know, stuff. But hey, maybe I'm just talking nonsense. I need to quickly save it for no other reason than just because. Excuse me, excuse me, Mr. Zhao. Knock, knock. Wang Ho called. You're looking for someone. Hmm. Did I already say that? I'm always saying things like that. Maybe I just already covered this. I don't know where your friend is, but I know the Tong are involved. The leader of the Tong, Johnny. He'll know where they are. Sweet. So... Hmm. It'll dribble from his lips, mingle with blood if I must. Johnny's at Glaze. It's his club. You'll need a password to enter. Need a password to get into the a club? The password is 725. There will be Tong everywhere. Johnny's office is upstairs. Hmm. Your benevolence is a mystery to me. I am a man of my word, and I owe the debt to Wong Ho. By paying that debt, I have made an enemy of the Tong, who I once belonged to. Hmm. Wait. They're coming. You should leave now. We know it was you. Mm, do you mind if I eviscerate a few? I am very bored. Excuse me. Yo, you should get down. Trust me on this. Woo! Oh, that was a lot of guns. Okay, my berserker is not doing what I want him to. That's fine. Luckily, I'm also incredibly strong. Is the old man still there? Nice. Let's get some blood back. I'm gonna need it when I. Ow! Oh, dude. Okay, he's dead. Come on. Who's left alive? You look reasonably alive. Ah, don't magnum him. I could, you know, use draining this one. Seriously, don't shoot him while I'm draining him. This is important. What did I just say? Great. Well, if I frenzy, this is gonna be your fault. Oh, crap. Okay. Guess I can only do one of those at once. You're alive up there, Zell. Mm, he's not firing anymore. Seems unlikely. That's kind of his problem. Do not shoot him, crazy man. Wow, he sounds like he's having a bad time. Hmm, good figure. Well, that's that dealt with. Are you still alive over there? Oh, hello. What are you doing hiding down there in the boxes? Do you think I didn't see you? Well, I probably would have done if you'd have just left amicably. But now I'm just gonna drain you like some sort of blood popsicle. Bloodsicle? Pops the blood? Hmm. Whatever. That everybody? Mm, I think Zhao's dead. Mm, Zhao's dead. On the plus side, cold anaconda. You can save him uh, if you go down there and like do a load of damage. Uh, easier with uh, different professions, I feel. Different professions, <laughs> different clan. Uh, like the like when I was playing the uh, blood mage, you could just blow up a load of people really quickly. Anyway, one human's death isn't really a massive problem. So. We need to go into a club. That's fine. I wonder if we can talk our way out in this club. As much as I love kicking the shit out of literally everything, sometimes it's nice just to, you know... Ooh. Stupid number lock. Ruining everything ever. Oh, a lot of heavily armed goons. Nice enough club. 
I could always dance, I suppose. Hey guys, can I dance too? Yeah, I look pretty good in my new digs, I think. Nice. Oh, sorry, sorry, did you want to dance with me? Well, by all means. Come, low textured females and males, dance with me. Nice. Can you join me there? Good stuff. You are all hideous. Hmm, DJ's getting involved too. Excuse me, you, fellow that's slightly high textured as everybody else. Am I supposed to know you? Hmm, Johnny's gonna tell me his secrets. You don't look like someone he needs to talk to. Oh. Hmm. Let's see, I could be aggressive here. Let's see. Mm, who do I look like? Are they pretty? Huh. You know who runs this place? You think you can take out everybody here, huh? Bitch? Uh-oh. Guess we're fighting, people. Mass this fool! Well, if in doubt, get involved in a bit of a scramble. Alright, you can go berserk. Ah! That was sad. That was very sad. I didn't save it. I'm not gonna have to do this all again. I am gonna have to do this all again. Fantastic. Huh, well that time I just kind of stealthed my way out, which was amusing, it kind of worked. Let's see if we can enter the club invisible. I tried talking my way past. I wonder if I can stealth my way past. <laughs> okay, well, screw talking then. Well, that worked. Hello. Who do you think you are, bitch? Huh? You know who I am? You know who you are? You want to die? Ooh. Mm. This. Thugs, bless you. Easy meat. The fuck do you want? Huh? Who are you? Hmm. You look like the helpful type, which is good because I need assistance. Who told you that? How, how, how would you know about that? Who are you? Answer me. Hmm. I am an FBI cop, fireman, first degree black belt with a devil make her attitude. Don't tell it a thing, Johnny. Shoot it. You told me that guy was a nobody. Just what the hell did you get us involved in? Shoot it. You'll find out. You're dead, bitch. Rude. What the fuck? I shot you. You're dead. That's exactly it, Johnny. It is dead. Hey, I am here, you know. Kill something that's already dead. And I assure you, it's not wearing a vest. The bullet entered. You can tell. It's the tits. Lower abdomen. But this one wears protection. Normally, a bullet of that caliber would likely ricochet and tear up the small intestine. But as you can see, it exited cleanly through the back with little external bleeding. The reason being, its internal organs have atrophied. Um. Hmm. So, where is this show taped? I want to meet the star. Or why the star this time? What the hell's going on? W what are you? Dispose of Johnny, and we'll discuss the matter of your missing comrade. Sweet. I am your executioner. Hey, hold on. I just realized me stealthing through this is probably gonna get me killed. Well, let's drain Johnny first. Johnny's rubbish. Goodbye, Johnny. You had to kill him, didn't you? It's part of your code of survival, covering your tracks, so to speak. No, and I just did it because he was nasty. Nice. me, you should know I'm monitoring your heat signature. It's room temperature. Oh no, I'm deceased. <laughs> when did this happen? <laughs> so, what's your nature? I also must protect my true identity. You may refer to me as the Mandarin. Like the orange? You are searching for one of your kind, I understand. I have him at my facility. Come to the Fu Syndicate building. We will discuss terms of release. I'm almost there. Give me five minutes and a shitload of dead people. Who needs dead people? 
Sometimes it's better to make it a mystery. Boo. Psst. That one over there. I gave you crabs. Just thought you'd like to know. Sneaky does it. So the food syndicate building, hey? Sure, why not? Hmm. Yeah, I can't turn invisible in plain sight, but we can get out of here. Excuse me, strange looking fellow. Pop! Let's pop into existence for a load of people. You saw nothing. Nothing. Luckily, the Foo Syndicate building happens to be right here in Chinatown. Weird, hearing things. I guess I just walk in the door. You, sir, can I talk to you? Hey, you're the one who crashed your car earlier. I should kill you for that. Eh, details. What do we do, just walk straight in? I mean, does that seem like a sinister logo to anyone else? I mean, there's a sword going through the world. I guess that means I can bash people's heads in. Score. So glad you finally decided to show up. If you want to meet your comrade, walk through those doors. Those doors? Think you scare me? No. I'm coming. Good. I am told you are a rather resourceful individual. This should make you a most intriguing specimen. Alice doesn't care. Look at this. You and your kind may play mortals for weaklings and fools, and that may be fitting for some. But you underestimate me. Really? Blah, blah, blah. Go on, try your tricks. What do you want? Subject is female. Appearance suggests early to late twenties. True age unknown. Hmm. Bulletproof glass, huh? As Very with bulletproof. The other, there are no vital signs. Hmm? No heartbeat. No body heat. Test chamber air sample is ninety-seven percent carbon monoxide. Normal respiration cannot take place. Hmm. Subject is, by all definition, clinically dead. Mm -hmm. Hello in there. Hey. I'm going to run some tests on you. I'm interested in how you work, but only because it's my task to find the most efficient way to kill your kind. Please, give me everything you've got. Sure. Begin the experiment. Ah! Test chamber has been filled with ultraviolet light, releasing moderate UV radiation. Does that burn at all? No, but it's very bright. Can you stop that? Ugh. Subject exhibits no sign of pain or even physical discomfort. I don't know, it is kind of bright. Shut down the lights. Thank you. Conclusion. UV radiation does not produce the desired effect. Please, move on to the next chamber. Sure. If you cooperate, your mind is resourceful. Your survival instinct borders on animalistic. I'm curious about your innate abilities. Let us see what you can do. The walls are reinforced concrete, several feet thick. There is no other exit. Believe me, it is my design. Okay. What was this one to test? But I could dodge some, like, poor lasers or what? Eh, details. Hmm. Well, his stupid little speech gave me some time to, you know, get rid of the popper cap in his ass. Ooh. Only the most simple have shown great resilience so far. Yes. Let's see how you do against some live targets. Live targets? Mm. Now that is my favorite word. Sometimes Along with cheese. I like cheese. Oh, and boudoir. Legitimate boudoir is a good word. Let us find out if there's any truth in an old superstition. Sure, knock yourself out. Initiate Van Helsing experiment. Does that hurt? I'd rather the experiment didn't end here. Please, don't disappoint. Die. Goodbye. Well, when God fails, put your faith in the gun. Proceed, Commander. Anyone really see me? Nope. The men are veteran mercenaries. The weapon modifications are my own design. Refined incendiary rounds are promising. Suggest few tests. 